All right, Keith, thank you so much for jumping on this call. I appreciate it. Thanks for having me. Yeah, so you messaged me uh, last week saying that you're having a record-breaking month and that you're experiencing great results with this sales training program. So tell me all about it. What were you struggling with in your agency? And what did you implement for my sales training program that has produced a record month for you? Absolutely. I got to tell you, um, <laughs> listening to your your content is a breath of fresh air because what it does is it validates to all of us um, working inside my agency and, and other agencies that I've talked to regarding the struggles that they've had. What you've done is you've you've broken it down to a science and you've you've essentially demonstrated that you're not alone. Everyone is is facing the same objections, the same intro objections, the same purchase objections. And, and what you have done is you've supplied us with some very quick, easy ways to be able to address them and overcome them and ultimately lead to that sale. Um, so that's that's hands down one of the, uh, the, 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 the immediate improvements that my agency and my staff have, uh, have seen immediately. That's incredible. So happy to hear that. Yeah, the objections are always the same, regardless if you're an Allstate agent, State Farm agent, Farmer's agent, independent yeah. agent. Uh, so give me some real numbers, Keith, of the before the training versus after the training. And if you have specific case studies of uh, team members in your agency that have seen exponential growth, I want to hear about that. Yeah. So, is it, it, prior to joining your uh, your your training platform, we were averaging anywhere from 120 to 140 items a month amongst my agency. Mm -hmm. Last month, <clears throat> we saw a, a, a record-breaking month. We did 219 items, so a tremendous improvement. Um, um, for $109,000 in new business premium, which is absolutely amazing. It's absolutely outstanding. There's a gentleman that's on my staff who has always been a leader, but now he is it just, he, he's, he's allowed uh, the training um, to really kind of accelerate his, his success to where now he's up to about 80 items now, just this month, month to date. And we still have several days left uh, in the month. Wow, and where was he previously? as an average? He, he was a 50, a 45, a 50 type of, uh, you know, uh, item per, uh, per month producer. Yeah. So, so very, yeah. Yeah. Which is still pretty good for a lot of agencies. They would take that kind of team member any day. Um, Absolutely. That's, that's awesome. And this has all been in just one month of implementing the program. Is that right? Yes. And, 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 and it's because what you've done is you've simplified that process and you've broken down why people say the things that they say when we call them. And that's the, the uh, reactionary uh, response. Help me out. The RDR. Reactionary defensive response. Yeah. <laughs> that's right. And, and understanding why people say what they say and, and not one and not taking it personal, but two, knowing exactly what to say back to them as opposed to just kicking off the phone or trying to steamroll through. And, and that in itself has led my team to more quotes and more quotes leads to more sales mm -hmm. uh, if you're doing it correctly. So absolutely, man, we're very, very thrilled. Yeah, that's incredible. Thank you for that feedback. Um, one of the things that I appreciate most about the script is if done correctly, you can get someone from a stranger to someone who is giving you their payments information in one call. Talk to me about the experience that your team has had with that and implementing the six step, six step script to one call close. We have had more structured conversations since implementing the six, the six step one call close than we've had before uh, in, in, in being associated uh, as being an insurance agency. We have had um, our sales cycle at our agency has is on average around three weeks from literally from the first point of contact to callbacks to going through different options to ultimately closing that's a three-week process and we're starting to see some 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 cases where that is closing down we're starting to see more one call closes uh, and it's due to that structured type of talk path in conversation that, that your training provides.
Um, so yes, we're, we're uh, in, in, in some cases where we're getting some rebuttals, we're now overcoming them, which is leading to more one call closes. And uh, it's been a vast improvement uh, here with my team. That's incredible. Uh, and within the script, there's the hook, building value, multi-lining policies, the cost presentation, asking for the sale, objection, mm -hmm. beginning and end. Which part do you feel like has added the most immediate value to your agency and has produced immediate results? Is it just one step or a few of the steps? Talk to me about that. It's a combination of all, but, but more importantly, um, I think everybody that we come across, uh, as far as a prospect, are all looking to save money. And they save that money based on judging apples to apples comparison in terms of coverage. Mm -hmm. And what your training has done is, is it, it, it allows us to be able to kind of flip the script on them a little bit. Instead of offering, let's say, $500 for a comp and collision, maybe do a $500 deductible for collision and a zero deductible for comp. So, so it's no longer about price. Now it's more about value, especially if you need a new windshield switched out instead of paying out of pocket because your deductible is so high. You know, uh, having a, repl a, a windshield replaced for zero money out of pocket is going to add value. You. So it's no longer about whether we're saving you money or not, because we're giving you the ability of, of gauging that. We're now creating that, that value and we're justifying asking for, uh, for a policy if it were 10 or 15 or $20 more a month mm -hmm. because that value was there. Yeah, yeah. And I think where the aha moments happen for a lot of the agents and team members as they're going through the training is that sure reducing the deductible is a very common thing that a lot of agents do but it's specifically how you present that to the client or to the prospect is what gets them to experience that epiphany of oh that is so much better because anybody can say hey you have a 500 dollars deductible now you have a zero dollar deductible here's what that means versus taking them through somewhat of an emotional uh, conversation of how that could impact them so oh, Mm. Yeah, yes. absolutely. Those those life stories uh, and, and kind of painting those pictures is emotional pictures from uh, from um, making sure that they're properly insured for property damage to deductibles to I mean to other perils like transportation expense and roadside assistance. Painting those pictures, especially if they don't have that type of coverage now, can really kind of emotionally motivate them to want to onboard with us as opposed to staying with that little stripped down coverage insurance policy that they have, but they thought it was amazing at mm -hmm. the price point in which they were paying. Yeah. Um, especially when they see the value in, in paying a little bit more. So it's absolutely amazing. Yeah. So what's the next step for you? What's the next uh, goal for you now that you've cracked 200 items a month? Yeah. The next step is actually to start into the referral program to where we can start growing uh, a team of centers of influence to start referring business in, whether it be realtors or loan officers or doing a, a referral program, uh, giving away $10 gift cards for every quote that we get and start really kind of encouraging other folks to spread the word about us and, and start uh, and start that referral process. We would like our phones to ring more than what they're currently doing. I'm sure everyone would like to, I uh, probably can agree with the statement that, that would be watching this. And that's the next step for us. And I feel like if we can achieve 219 items for $109,000 a month, with what we're currently doing, and that's buying internet leads and doing some Facebook marketing, if we can get an army of realtors, loan officers, clients referring business in, we're gonna see 300, 350, 400, uh, not to mention our phone ringing off the hook, which is always an amazing feeling for us. Yeah, that's yep. so incredible and refreshing to hear. A lot of agents who are watching this have this limiting belief and I see this on my Facebook uh, comments and thread where agents are saying, I don't believe it. 100 apps or 100 items per month is impossible, especially for one producer or 150 items is not possible. That's true. It's impossible if you're doing the wrong things. But if you have a structure in place, 
Um, it's like a recipe. If you follow the recipe as intended, you're going to get one outcome every time. So yep. it's refreshing to hear agents like yourself dreaming uh, so, so big and aiming for three, 400 items a month. That's incredible. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, well, cool. Keith, to wrap this up, what do you have to say to the agent who is watching this video and they're thinking about signing up for the Double My Sales Bootcamp? What would you tell them? You know, uh, I, I will say this, and I'll be brutally honest with you. The first time that I watched your video or I saw your very your, your, your little video clip on Facebook, I was like everybody else. I don't believe it. This is just another type of training gimmick. Oh, you know, this is you're your one in a, in a dozen people that are in my timeline selling me on a service that could better my results. And, and I get that because there are a lot of different services that are out there. What validates you, what validates your training content is, is one where, and this is a little bit different, is you're not an agency owner telling me and my staff how to do things. Uh, my staff absolutely loves your content because they see you as somebody that has worked in the trenches. Mm -hmm. and as you know, as a licensed sales producer working for an agent, wanting to take the next step and really kind of make a name for yourself, but also to achieve what everyone else says that's impossible. Mm -hmm. So everything that you you cover in your your content is one that my my staff goes, you know what? That's so true because that happens to me all the time. And I didn't realize that initially when, when I saw, you know, your, your advertisements, when I clicked on your webinar and I started reading through your content, there was a lot of aha moments and not to mention I was doing it out on my sales floor and which my staff was starting to hear the content that you say, and they were really starting to turn their heads like, Hey, you know, that's true. <laughs> so, um, so, so it was a no brainer for me after being exposed to your content in the very brief period of time that I was to say, you know what? Blot is onto something here. Blot is speaking truth. Blot is not talking to me from an agency owner to an agency owner and telling me how to train my staff. No, this is a very different, but extremely effective and accurate approach to taking what opportunity you have and turning it into the success that you always envisioned it to be. Mm -hmm. And, uh, and that's, that's going to be the claim to fame with you. And of course, with my guys is, is the approach that you're taking and, and how you break it down in the simplicity that you do. Yeah. Well, that means the world to me truly, Keith. I, I can't thank you enough for that feedback. Um, we're only one month into it, so we're going to stay cool and <laughs> we're going to see where you are a year from now. Hopefully it's a completely different, um, environment in a better way. So thanks so much. And uh, I'll go ahead and end the recording right here.